Hello all, welcome to this session. In this session, I am going to provide a solution for an issue which is occurring on running the Selenium automation scripts on Chrome browser. So what is that issue? We are getting this IO exception, guys. Okay, when you are running your automation scripts, that is Selenium automation scripts on Chrome browser, we are getting this exception known as IO exception. Let me show you that practically first. So here in Eclipse ID, I created a project. Okay, for Selenium and I configured this project with Selenium library. I'll open this form.xml file. As you can see under the dependencies stacks, I have added 4.8.1 version of Selenium Java. I even tried with 4.8.0 and 4.7.9. Still, you're getting the same issue. Okay, whatever the version you take, we are getting the same issue. The reason behind the issue is not this Selenium version, but rather the issue is all related to this Chrome browser version, guys. Okay, if you are using a Chrome browser version of 311.x, then you are going to get this issue of Selenium. Okay, so let me check my browser version first. I'll open my Chrome browser here. Click on these three dots and go to this help and say about Google Chrome. And uh, you can clearly see my browser version is 311.x. So in that case, I'm going to get this issue, right? So what I'm going to do here is uh, just to show you that issue, whatever I'm facing. So now, so inside this main method, I'm going to write the code like this, okay? Web driver, driver is equal to new Chrome driver. Like this, I'm going to write this statement and import this Chrome driver class from Selenium library and import this uh, web driver also from Selenium library, okay? So this this should launch the Chrome browser. It will launch, guys, okay? When I'm running this code, uh, it's launching my Chrome browser, but the problem is I'm also getting that exception, guys. Uh, let me show you that. Let me run this code, give an exception. We'll open the browser, but at the same time, we are getting an exception. In the, you see the browser got launched, Chrome browser got launched, at the same time, we got this IO exception. Along with that, we got one more exception. That is connection failed exception. Okay. So why we are getting these exceptions? The reason behind that is this Selenium automation scripts are unable to run on the Chrome browser version having version as triple one dot X. That's the problem. That's the reason behind that. Okay. So there is a problem. Okay. There is a problem with Selenium where it's not running the automation scripts on this particular version of the Chrome browser. For that, guys, uh, there is a temporary fix. Okay, there is a temporary fix that we can follow. If you if you are halted because of this problem of Chrome browser triple uh, triple one, right? You can apply this fix. So until we get a next fix uh, in the next latest version of uh, Selenium, right? Okay, till then there is no other way. Okay, so in whatever the version of Selenium, if you are getting this issue, just simply apply this fix for now, temporary fix for now. In the upcoming version of Selenium. There is a fix for that. Okay. The fix for that is coming in the upcoming version of the Selenium. So currently the version of Selenium is, you know, 4.8.1. I tried with 4.8.0, 4.7.9, everywhere it is coming. Okay. But in the next version, that is 4.8.2, the issue will be fixed automatically. You don't have to write to or do whatever I'm trying to do it here. Okay. So here you see what happens if this kind of exception will come, the next steps will not be executed. Guys, okay. This line is given exception means the next statements will not be executed. Right. So I'll simply write down driver dot manage dot window dot maximize here then driver dot get none of the steps will be executed guys okay it will launch the chrome browser and just give an exception and because of which next steps will not be executed here i'll give the application url let's give the application url that is a tourism.com slash demo copy this url and uh, paste it here fine now run the code you'll get an exception here after launching the browser you'll get an exception here because of which the next two statements will not be executed. not it will neither maximize the browser window nor it will open the application url in the browser window run this script just observe that what's happening you see it has launched the chrome browser but you know it has not maximized it has not opened the application url because of this exception i exception is coming here and here we are getting connection failed exception okay because of which these statements are not getting executed so what is the fix so the fix is here guys okay it is a temporary solution only we have to wait for the next version of the selenium to get this fixed automatically internally okay we don't have to write this code uh, whatever i'm trying to give the temporary fix right that code you don't have to write in the next versions of the selenium so what we have to write here is uh, we need to create an object for the chrome options to avoid this fix we have to create an object for the chrome options and uh, you know i'll say options is equal to and here I'll declare this with the uh, Chrome options. And I'll import this Chrome options from Selenium. 
And after that, using this object reference, options dot add arguments. And here in double quotes, I'll provide an argument, guys. Okay. Hyphen, hyphen. Okay. So this argument I have to give hyphen, hyphen, remote allow origins is equal to hashtag symbol. Okay. Remote hyphen, allow hyphen origins is equal to hashtag symbol. Like this, you give this. Uh, okay. okay. Now provide these options into the constructor of this Chrome driver. Okay. Otherwise, this this Chrome options will not be applied for this browser. Okay. And you will still get the issue if you don't if you forget to provide these options here, you will get the, still get the issue. Guys. Okay. So let me now close all this stuff and uh, freshly run the script. Okay. Let me run the script this time. You see, it should maximize it should open the application URL in the browser because here we should not get an exception. Okay. So run the code. This is a temporary fix, guys. This is what we have to do temporarily until you get the next version of Selenium where this fix will be done automatically. In the next version, you don't have to write this extra code. Still, we are getting the issue. Uh, what is the problem here? Maybe I have done some mistake here. Chrome options, options is called new Chrome options. Options dot add arguments, double quotes. I'm giving this. So remote hyphen, hello hyphen, or e. You see, spelling mistake, origins. Okay. Now run this code. This time it will work. Close this browser first of all. So it will launch the Chrome. This time it will work, guys. Okay. If, I'm, if you are giving without any spelling mistakes under, it will work. You see, it's working fine. You see, it's oh, maximize the browser window and open the application. That means the exception has not occurred in the first step. Right? You see, there is no exception in the output console. So this uh, temporary fix, guys, uh, in the next version of the Selenium. Currently, I'm using uh, which version of Selenium here? 4.8.1 version I'm using. So in the next version, that is 4.8.2, which is not at release when I'm recording this session. If I, I can show you that, okay? So let's go to the ambient repository here and search for that repository.com and uh, search for Selenium Java. Just type uh, Selenium Java here and click on search button. Click on this link. It will be taken to this page. You see the latest version is 4.8.1. 8.1. Even though I am using 4.8.0 or uh, old version 4.7.2 and so on, right? The issue is coming because the problem is not with this. Uh, these versions are not supporting the Chrome browser version 3.1. Okay. So when you're down downgrading your Selenium version, this fix is compulsory in Chrome browser now, guys. Okay. The otherwise, there's no way. Okay. Now in the next version of the Selenium 4.8.2 onwards, uh, okay. 4.8.2 onwards, the fix will be automatic in inbuilt. You don't have to write this code, extra code to resolve the problem. Okay. If you're using 4.8.1 or below versions, then you have to write this code for Chrome browser only, not for other browser. Other browsers are working fine. The Firefox, Edge, and everything is working fine. Only for Chrome browser, we're getting this issue. Because of that Chrome browser version three point one point X. Okay, so guys, you got the solution. Uh, how to on how to resolve this problem with uh, running of Selenium automation scripts on the Chrome browser in this session. So that's all for this session. Thank you. Bye.